Hey guys, it's Hedgy, and we're back with what could possibly be the finale to Pokemon Sword. Last time, we handled the rest of the post-game and got another ending screen. <laughs> In this episode, we're going, we're going to one place. Just one. You see, we don't have any sort of directive. It's because we're going to one place and one place only. The Battle Tower. Why the Battle Tower? Because, let's face it, I haven't done anything in the Battle Tower yet. I haven't even touched the Battle Tower. But, let's talk to you real quick. What's up? I'll keep battling and steadily raise my rank. Okay, cool. Wait, let me look at my team real quick. Do I have my original team back on me? No, I don't. Okay. So, let's go ahead and replace Zation. Back, put Victoria back in the party. Had Zation long enough for the part for the uh, hot battle. Nothing major. But anyway, let's go ahead and go to um, this lady over here. Hi. Whoa, ho, hey, hey there, Type Null. What is up with you, sir? Mugu? Mugu to you, too. All right. But, nope, I tend to want to talk to Type Null again. I want to talk to you. Electric memory on. This will help save on the electric bill. What? Goo? Goo -moo? Yeah, indeed. Indeed. Guess it really doesn't work until Type Null evolves. Drat. Oh, Champions Null. Oh, hi. <laughs> it probably goes without saying at this point, but congratulations on your victory. To commemorate your achievements, I present you with this rare Pokemon, Type Null. Oh, well, thanks. <laughs> Thank you for this Type Null, ma'am. All right. So type nulls, data is added to Pokedex, 6'3, 265, 7. That's pretty heavy. Rumor has it that the theft of top secret research notes led to a new instance of this Pokemon being created in the Galar region. So basically, somebody went to Ether, stole their research notes, and moved to Galar. I'm not giving it a nickname. I'm sending it to the box. I wanted to evolve it on screen, but I mean, it evolves through friendship. I received the memories, though. It evolves to friendship, and, um, I'd rather not go through all that. Alright, but our main attraction is this area here. Wait, this area here. Thank you for coming. This is the Battle Tower. Yeah, that, I just mentioned this. Can I help you with something? Uh, I want to battle. Please select the battle format and the Pokemon you'd like to take part. Okay. So, in the Battle Tower... You're separated by tiers. You got the beginner tier, the Pokeball tier, Great Ball, I think it goes Pokeball, Great Ball, Ultra Ball, Master Ball. Future me can correct me on this, but we're going to go use the single battle format. And I'm going to use my party. Now just, just an example, um, right now, let's see, I can only put three in at a time, and this is going to be a tricky situation. I look at it this way. I gotta be careful. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and put in Kitty. Scooter. And Victoria. Just as a test to see what goes on in this thing. And then you go. Oh, and they kick you right on out. Alright, cool. So what's up? Who's first? Businessman! Here, let me give you my card. What? You don't have a business card? Don't rub it in, my dude! I know I don't. I'm also a 10-year-old kid. <laughs> Why would I have a business card? Office worker Hugo? S. Cavalier. Of course you would. That's fine. I send out the perfect Pokemon for your S. Cavalier. Go, kitty! Alright, so we have the ability to Dynamax. As w well, we're on top of Rose Tower. Of course we do. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and start with the uh, Flame Charge on this S. Cavalier real quick. It has a berry. Wait, what? That must be a weak, uh, weak in the move berry. That would be a, yeah, Oka berry. Yeah, Oka berry, um, lowers damage from super effective fire type moves. Also, a taunt, uh, which means I can't use stealth rock. Shoot. I can once the taunt wears off the, oh, there you go. <laughs> that was easy enough. Okay, so his Cavalier's out. I'm mad. I probably should have went for Stealth Rock first. Lapras. Oh, no, 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 no. Wait, what if I run? What, why do I have a run option? <laughs> why do I have a run option? 
I can't run. This is a trainer battle. At least I don't think I can run. I mean, what? They give you the option to run? Also, Waterfall looks pretty cool. We're gonna go for Wild Charge. This should hopefully um, knock it out in one hit. Yep. Sorry, Frank. But your Lapras is in another castle. By the way, I got a crit. That's gonna hurt, by the way. Because Wild Charge. Uh, yeah, I'm still alive. Okay, cool. And Vanilla. Jeez, I have a choice. I choose to put in Kitty. <laughs> because Kitty. Kitty has moves, all moves that can affect ice types. And yeah, you got Flame Charge, you got Stealth Rocks, you got uh, Ancient Power, Icicle Crash. That's not gonna do anything. Like, Icicle Crash is resisted. Uh, Kitty cares not for your Icicle Crash. Ancient Power. Protect. No, uh, don't protect yourself. Better protect yourself before you wreck yourself. What? That made more sense in my head. I don't care. Let's try that again. The Ancient Power. Imprison. Wait, what are you imprisoning? You have Ancient Power? Oh. You bet not have Ancient Power. Now you're gonna take an Ancient Power to the face. Okay. And I know you don't have Flame Charge. Wait, what? Wait, what do you have on you? Leftovers. Of course you do. Here. Leftovers these. Protect. Ah, crap. Gonna just heal up again. Come on. Let me at least get a couple of moves off on your face. Says... Faces. You have two of them. They are faces. One's happier than the other. Icicle crash. Okay. Yeah, this is your... This is your, uh... This is the last move right here. I'll tell you that right now. Vanillux. You suck. Go away. Oh, you didn't die? What? That last leftover actually meant something. And I'm pretty sure you're gonna protect next turn. So, yep, there it is. Uh, I thought it was the last move. The next move is the last move. I'll tell you that right now. So, you get the protect. That means my speed won't increase. You'll get a little bit of leftover boost. Then I have to heal fully. I'm gonna be upset. I still can crush. You're still faster than me for some reason. Is Vanillox known for being, like, super fast or something? At least not that I know of. Go flame charge. And dead. Alright, there we go. I knew that would get the last move eventually. Alright, there's my business card. Since we're both trainers, I guess we could trade lead cards. Do you have a lead card? No, I just get 2 BP out the deal. Yeah, we'll continue battling. What the hell? I mean, I'm trying to make this up. Trying to push this episode. Wait, I'm battling another one? I just popped over for a battle during my break time, so let's make this quick. Wait. Do you work at the same company as Hugo? Office worker Stanley? Who's now for Kaparaja? Perfect. Just like they know my team. Go Kitty. <laughs> Alright, Kaparaja is pure steel type. I don't even need a Dynamax. I have the option. I don't need it though. Go Flame Shark. Protect. That upsets me. That, that wounds me, Office worker Stanley. Why don't your Kaparaja just take this flame charge? I'm faster than it though. It's also very bulky. That's fine. Just work my, spe my speed up. Oh, Heavy Slam. Heavy Slam's not gonna hurt that bad though. Yeah, cause I think they're like pretty comparable in weight. Oh, you have leftovers, don't you? Yes, you do. That's fine. Gives me the perfect opportunity to set up. South Rocks. Then Hedgy comes up with the Stealth Rocks. Uh, I should probably be a... Oh, screw you. <laughs> Just everybody throws out Stealth Rocks. <laughs> uh, which means I gotta rock... I'm gonna hopefully rock with Kitty the rest of the match. I don't wanna take too much Stealth Rock damage. Uh, let's go for the... St let's go Flame Charge again to protect. No, oh, it's gonna be one of these battles, isn't it? My poor computer can't take this. <laughs> Why are we making a battle tree episode la or battle tower episode last 30 minutes? About 30 minutes. 10 minutes already. We're at 10 minutes. And I've only done one battle. You know what? I have three turns. Let's make this work. <laughs> I know. This seems kind of like 
overkill, but I'm be sitting here forever with this Kaparaja, and I'm not willing to sit here forever with this Kaparaja. No, um, here, have yourself a very merry kitty. What? <laughs> You've upset the kitty, by the way, and for that, you die. And that only did half damage. That's fine. Anything I can do to get this Copper Raja off the field. Ooh, sunny day. Nice. Whirlwind. Ha! You can't roll me in, win me out, dude, while I'm Dynamax. So that actually worked in my favor. Let's go for another, uh... Okay. I think we'll protect. Dynamax moves take a little... They, yeah, Dynamax moves still go in effect, but it's, uh, damage is half. Yeah. You can't protect yourself from a Dynamax move. Well, you can, but you'll still take damage. I'm gonna burn it on my moves. Screw this, Max Flare. Will you stop using Protect? Okay. Yeah. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just not gonna spend all my time trying to protect. I mean, trying to get rid of this Copperaja when I can just Dynamax and now I have to return back to normal size, don't I? Glycopod. Okay. So. I just the damage. Uh, it's probably gonna. I wanted to go for first impression. Uh, let's go for ancient power. All right. Hopefully, ancient power knock it out in one shot. No, but it did a decent amount and kicked it out of the battle. All right, cool. <laughs> Noiburn, you are also weak to rocks, <laughs> and you get stealth rock damage. You too are weak to ro Tailwind. Oh, well, it's faster than me though. There lies the problem. Because I'm going for ancient power. Look at this. You're not dead. Dang it. Ah, uh -uh. sunlight faded. Dang it. I could have taken advantage of that situation. That's fine. I got one more. Defog. Oh, Defog's gonna get rid of Stealth Rocks. Ah, crap. Uh, okay. Oh, Defog got rid of all rocks. So I'm, I'm able to switch out no problem. Now, thank you, Noivern, for being a being a gentleman and a scholar. Oh, wait, where are you female? All right, now I'm still taking damage from Stealth Rock. So let's go ahead and go for one more Ancient Power. Muddy Water, oh no. Wait, Muddy Water's ground type. I think that would that'd be normal. Uh, I bet say, well, it didn't matter. Kitty fainted. Uh, let's see, who I got? I got Scooter and I got Victoria. And Victoria can, um, prey on that water typing. Real quick. With a quick wild charge and end this battle, right? Yep. There we go. And battle end. Alright, cool. We did it. That's two, y'all. I'll take a little bit of damage from recoil and poop. Well, that's that. My break time sure went quickly. Your break time... Most of your break was spent with that Kaparaja. Hey, I got two VP. Nice. Wait, that's it? Congratulations, you moved up in ranks. You're now rank two. You've earned a reward for moving up through the ranks. Oh, I got a piece of candy. Nice. Piece of rare candy. And three more VP. Good work in there. The battle tower is ready whenever you are. Dare I go into it again? You know what? At this rate, I'm gonna go with explore a little bit around town around the town until we get a, like a dynamax encounter mainly because i want to end and end on a dynamaxing i mean it wouldn't hurt right so let's see so we're gonna uh, we're just gonna wait it out i guess but uh, all right but as for future plans for my next project uh right now i don't have any I have absolutely no plans for a new project as of this recording, which is taking place on, I'm dating this episode, January 29th of 2020. By the time you see this episode, I also picked up the air balloon, which is going to um, give the Pokemon that's holding it a chance to float in the air and um, be immune to ground type moves, which is cool, actually. You know what? I think I can go to the wild area, right? Yeah, let's go to the wild area. I said the wild area, not the options. Um, big difference. There's the difference between wild area and options. 
Uh, let's see. Water. East Lake Axwell. I just want to, you know, do probably one Dynamax battle. Or G Max battle or something. Unfortunately, no one's doing one right now. It really kind of sucks. Because I want to... My intention, hopefully, as... Usually, also, by the way, whenever you become champion, any, like... Any Dynamax, like, spot or power spots you encounter that have the red light will give you 200 watts instead of 20. Or 50, rather. And that... And ones with a... With a Dynamax Pokemon like that one over there will give you a, um, as the hail kicked in, um, will give you 3,000 watts. Uh, huh. I'm just looking around at this point. But yeah, as of right now, I don't have any plans for, um, new footage. This is the actual, like, post game finale to Sword and Shield. I'm gonna let y'all know that right now. There's a white light up there. Wait, what is that white light? Also, it is kind of laggy. Oh, that's somebody's... T I think that's somebody's tent, actually. Uh, is that a tent? Uh, found a Pokeball right there. I think that was a tent. Wait, where'd it go? Where's the tent? I saw a light. I saw a light. Where is it? Hi, Garbrother. Bye, Garbrother. And uh, tent. Oh, uh, you know what? Fine. Ah, Lightbird. Hi, Lightbird. Fancy seeing you here, dude. I don't really care for you. What level are you? I could probably use you to... Yeah, you're level 60. Hmm. You know what? We're gonna run. We're gonna go ahead and uh, get away safely. Uh, as of right now, I've had plans of some games that I want to do once this episode finishes. I probably I'm thinking of starting like probably Sonic something Sonic based because last Sonic let's play I did was Mania and I haven't touched a Sonic game since then like well I haven't played one on um on a let's play in a while the last Pokemon I mean Sword let's play I mean Sonic let's play I did was um Mania of course um. I was going to say the last Mario one I did, but the last Mario one was before this project, actually. It was New Super Mario Brothers. Uh, Kirby, maybe? Because I haven't touched a Kirby game since Star Allies. I'm going to let y'all decide my next project, basically, when this video comes out. Well, hopefully before this video comes out. By the time this video actually gets released, I'll have my plan set up. Uh, let me ch I'm just at this point going around Wild Area talking about projects and stuff. But thoughts on this game? This game gets a lot more hate than it deserves. This game is freaking awesome. Sure, there are some issues. Of course there are some issues. There's always going to be issues with a video game. I mean, it doesn't matter. You're always going to have positives and you're going to have negatives. I'm going to go ahead and go with my negatives first and get them out of the way. The negatives. The beginning of the story is long. And I mean long. As you saw, it took me almost an, about two hours just to get to the first badge. Whoa. Oop, oop. I mean, I understand what they're trying to do. But it's like, at this point, I just wanted to, you know, catch some Pokemon and get the first gym badge. Um, that's, that's, that was a Hitmonlee, was it not? Is that him on Lee I just passed? Don't act like I ain't see you. Get over here. You'll be a good buddy to Scooter. I'll name you Slim. After Slim Kirby. Because it fits, okay? I thought to level 60. Uh, let's go for the flame charge. Mega kick. Alright, wait, I have quick balls. What am I doing? Alright, that was a crit, by the way. I don't want to hit it with anything else. Uh, let's go ahead and go for the uh, Ultra Ball. I have 30 of these. Hmm. I have a lot of Ultra Balls for some reason. Hey, I'm going to have to ask you to close combat. Oh, no. That's going to kill Kitty if I'm not careful. I want to catch you. You're part of my... You're not part of my team? 
but uh oop. but I want you to be just to be that one Pokemon that I can you know say hey look I caught you close combat ah, I'm gonna kill Kitty you killed my Pokemans and just for that and I can't I don't want to put Autumn in there we're gonna end up the end, the finale episode is just gonna be um Kitty died Kitty fainted <laughs> That's the end of the episode, and yeah, let's go for the T-Wave and then put this thing and paralyze it. Wait, does that T-Wave come from your mouth? But yeah, let me go with the positives. The positives are getting reversal. Oh, no. Uh, but yeah, the positives of this game, it looks beautiful. A lot of people are harking so hard on that this game looks like crap like a 3ds game just ported to the switch I've heard that before I've heard I've heard the whole argument about and I quote high quality animations and Victoria fainted dang it I'm losing my Pokemon here and I heard those but those arguments it's like I mean, it's a Pokemon game on the switch people just relax you get this is the second title you get for the switch like and it's, it's only the second Pokemon game that's come out for the Switch. Town, I mean, well, the first being the first one's being the Let's Go titles. I feel like just nowadays a lot of people want to complain, and to that I say, let people enjoy the game. That's all we ask. Also, I just caught him. I only I wasn't even paying attention. I just threw the ball. All right. So this amazing Pokemon has an awesome sense of balance. It can kick in succession from any position. We're naming it Slim. It's male, because that's all I'll hit my lead. I'll hit my lead. I'll hit my chain and all I'll um, hit my top are male. We're gonna send to the box. And on that note, uh, we're going to hopefully one last like one last search of um Did I max hit? Nothing to hit my lead. Thanks. Am I just in a fighting type area? Well, I saw it nick it there, so probably not. Um, hmm. I don't know. At this point, I feel like I'm just stretching episodes. So, um, come on. I'm probably just gonna go back to the meetup area, and next time, um, y'all might see more sword, but it'll be part of an, a different like thing. Greet it. No, greet it. Greet it. I see you over there. But yeah. Next time I do anything sword or shield related will be the expansion pass. Which should come out pretty soon. I think as if this video probably the next couple months. Um yeah. As we go through one more battle. With a sigilus. That's not how I'm ending this play. I'm just gonna go ahead and run from it. Autumn, do your thing. Harsh sunlight, run in from this sigilus. What? Sigilus. I'm gonna have to ask you to let me in the episode. So that way we can just go ahead and just call it a let's play at this point. <sighs> it's gonna be it's gonna be quite the thing seeing this game uh seeing this game be done at this point. With no more le uh, episodes left, I think I can go ahead and say that we're done here. Next time on if we're doing anything related to sword uh next time will be next time will be a different let's play all together man it does i'm not gonna lie it always hurts to see a finale to work with a finale because you put so much heart and soul into a project only to ha i mean like to end the project and just play the game on free time and you're just sitting there you're not want. I mean, you don't have an option to share it with the people unless you're streaming. And I mean, yeah, but doing. I mean, YouTube videos and stuff. I would love to share this game more often on um, YouTube. Unfortunately, I don't know what else I could possibly do. So, I get. Holy crap! That's a lot of Vulpix in Temple. Uh, well, you know what? We're going for the Gusto. We're going for one Dynamax battle. Is that a Gigantamax Alcremie? 
We're doing it. We're, I don't care how long this episode's gonna be at this point. We're taking on this G-Max out, Creamy. People, if you want in, three minutes. I'll see y'all in three minutes. It'll probably be about like three seconds for y'all. See y'all in a minute. All right, looks like nobody else is joining, so we're just gonna go ahead and start the battle. Uh, I hate that because now we don't have a choice. We're gonna have to start a battle. And it just gives us two AIs. I hate that, but it has to happen. All right, so our last Dynamax battle is a G-Max out creamy. Man. It's a five-star G-Max out creamy. So this thing is freaking awesome looking. It's huge. It's a big cake. We're celebrating with cake. A G-Max cake. Very big cake. I can I can Dynamax if I want to. Do I want to? Yes. I'm going for it. There's a reason I went ahead and brought out my um Corviknight. Fairy is weak to steel. I mean I could have always brought out Eternatus, but there's just no purpose for it. Because Eternatus is also part of Dragon type, and Fairy is strong against Dragon. So. Uh, okay, setting us up with a light screen. That's a big old light screen. Well, it's because I'm big. Max Steel Spike. That's gonna hurt you. That's gonna hurt y'all, Freeman. Okay, yeah. That didn't hurt like I thought it would. And I hate that because it's gonna be like, oh yeah, a creamy is getting desperate. Look at that, see? What'd I tell you? How creamy is getting desperate. And now oh, it's a five-star shield. Oh, that's right. And it's got Max Flare. Why? Why do you have Max Flare? Also, the harsh sunlight's kicked in. Wait, what fire-type move do you have that give, that causes Max Flare? Calm mind. Wait. Oh, I hate how they let this thing use more than one move back-to-back. -back. Electroweb. Yeah, go ahead and start breaking some sh um, shields up here. So that way, when I when I d eventually destroy it, uh, it won't um, don't do anything. Yeah, destroy at least Behemoth Bash. That should I think I want to say that will take out two. I think that's the one of the very few moves that takes out two uh, pieces of shield. Nah, just one. Okay, so it's like I guess it's like one hit moves and. Um, and max moves that will allow you to take off two pieces of the shield. I hate that. I really hate that because that's that's pretty silly. Okay, so let's drop this defense, specialty, max flare. I'm probably gonna have to use a turn to heal. I don't know if I'm gonna live. Nope, I'm dead. That's great. That's great. I blew up and died. This thing has max flare for some reason. Oh, I'm mad at myself. A creamy used calm mind. It has calm mind. That could explain everything. You have calm mind. Why do you have calm mind? Go for the electro web. Please get a paralysis. That was a crit. It did nothing. It lowered its speed though. That's good. Mega punch. Okay, that's also not going to do much anything. And shields are back up. I'm dead, so. Yeah, that, that's the thing. I'm still dead. So at this point, I'm only given the option to cheer on, check my Pokemon, or run from this battle. I'm, I don't have a choice but to cheer on. I'm hoping this helps us set up. We have a light screen up, so. Which is weird, because Max Flare is, uh, uh, can be either physical or special, depending on the move. And uh, I don't recall Al Creamy learning anything fire type. Unless there's something I'm not knowing. All right, hey, Zamasenta, I'm gonna have to ask you to, you know, make a move here. I'm currently recording a video. <laughs> you only get like 60 seconds per move. This video's already gotten to 32 minutes in length. <laughs> My dude, please, press A. Thank you, I had no choice, I'm dead, so I'm cheering for my side. Oh, sweet. Oh, it gave you a special attack boost. Which, 
does them uh, does throw no good. It's a physical Pokemon. <laughs> Heman Bash. Okay, that should knock off the shield uh, uh, shield point. I wish it, I wish Behemoth Bash knocked off two shield points. That would make more sense. Oh, that did damage. That did a decent amount of damage. Also, I think it does a bit of damage plus the um. Uh, and I got rid of our stat changes. Dang it. Giga Drain on who? On throw. I'm still dead. So. Dazzling Gleam on who? The Pikachu is still alive thanks to Focus Sash. Okay. I need to come back to life because I want to be able to, you know, start getting rid of that shield. We need to survive. I'm not going out on a failure, dang it. But I'm back. Go, Becky. I'm back on the field. All right, that's cool. Got pressure. That's fine. Let's see. Let's go for the... Uh, I guess we're going to go for the Al uh, Creamy. Uh, I guess we'll go for the Al Creamy. Yeah, that's what we're always going for. I guess we'll go for the uh, Steel Wing. I'm mad at myself, though. I let that... Just, I let it die. Okay. I guess going for the Behemoth Bash may work for... um. Is that Mazenta? I mean... Again, I mentioned, my dudes, I'm only recording for 30 minutes. Uh, I mean, I'm only recording a video or something. You know? Make your move. I'm sitting here rushing the people like that. They can hear me through a TV screen. Poor Pikachu. Just sitting there with like one hit point. Alright, so Behemoth... Okay, you're going first. Got Behemoth Bash. Hopefully Behemoth Bash... I think since I think it's since the, Di the Pokemon is Dynamax, it will take more damage. Okay, it will take damage. Uh, more damage as it's Dynamax, or maybe I'm thinking the Dynamax Cannon. I don't remember. Steel Wing and Max Mindstorm. Who's it hitting? Me. Why? Why was that just to set up Psychic Terrain? I'm guessing so. Because that did next to nothing to me. Battlefield got weird, though. Dazzling Gleam. Oh, yeah, that's fair. Just gonna knock out the Pikachu. Not very effective on me, though. I don't care. I care not for yours. Um, okay, you need to go ahead and knock it out, my dude. Just knock out the... Okay, you're bringing back your throw. Alright, I'm scared, actually. Because if we don't knock it out this turn... That's it. And here it goes. All you gotta do is hit Behemoth Bash. That is it. After you hit Behemoth Bash, I'm pretty sure that it's not gonna survive another Behemoth Bash. Uh, and we should be fine to catch it. And I would love to go to put this uh, Let's Play to rest by you catching a... By me catching a, gi a G-Max Al Creamy. That would be kind of cool, actually. Because I like G-Max Al Creamy. I think G-Max Al Creamy was the first G-Max Pokemon I remember seeing. I mean, I think this was even before G-Max Corviknight, but G-Max Alcrimi was more likely the first one I remember seeing. Yeah, there we go. Okay, good. You went for the Behemoth Bash. That's great. And it went, and it actually hit. I love Zamazenta's design, though. When it connects the uh, pieces of its, um, like, mane together. That's kind of cool. Okay, and it's dead. All right. Now, Creamy is weak. We're gonna go ahead and go for the catch. The Ultra Ball. I want, I could have just went for my Master Ball and been done with it, but it, I never use my Master Ball. Ever. Ever. Like, I hardly ever use my Master Ball. Why? Because I never have a reason to. Oh. Well, uh, so long, G Max out, Creamy. Uh, I'll just catch one off screen. That's fine. I defeated him. I got, I got an extra, a large candy, an extra large candy, two Dynamax candies, and then I have Papa, a Qualot, Tiny Mushroom, Bob Mushroom, and the TRs for Play Rough, Amnesia, and Future Sight. Not bad. Not bad. Okay, so we didn't catch the G Max Alcremie, but I guess we'll um, I'll do one more off screen. And, okay, next time, if when we come back to Sword and Shield, we will be going through the Expansion Pass. 
I'll see you then. Till then, for the final time in this part of the Let's Play. Edgy, out. Bye, yo.